hey guys welcome back to my channel and it's time for another vlog from my shop at eclecticism that's right my thrift boutique and the name again is eclecticism and so i wanted to give you an update on what i did and what i did not do what i did not do if you watch my last video i did not totally revamp this area that was the plan but we didn't get out of here until 12 o'clock midnight and so i just could not get everything done and we had to be front and center back the next morning so i decided to just make a few changes i added a lot of the new stuffies as you can see here so here are some of the new stuffies that my daughter did the vlog on my last video on my channel well since then I've already sold nine of the stuffies so that you know that was a good thing because they were a hit but as far as totally redoing the area I have not done so I did like I said I've added in some new pieces these guitars as we speak have already sold I did make a change as you can see I took uh, one of the dresses that I sourced and I put it on a teddy bear that we actually hauled in the last video and that's how I'm displaying it as she's sitting in the chair here are some of the stuffies that remain but like I said since then actually nine is not the number that I've sold I've actually sold 12 and but the area is coming along I did hang the frog as you can see I cleaned it I hung it I put this gorilla that I already had but I forgot to include it in the haul I also added the snake that my daughter picked out as she made a point to let you know I did put it on the uh, display at the top of the um, display well, you know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> but anyway, I did um, put it up there. And then also you can see some of the toys. And I think it still turned out really great, even though I haven't totally redone it. So now what changes have come about since then? Right here in this area, if you recall, I had a large set of beautiful goblets. Well, they have sold. And... I have yet to add some new glasses in place of it usually I keep a stock in the back of items that when they sell if I can I try to replace it but um, sometimes I can and sometimes I can't it just depends on what it is here is a hat that was in the hall um, I think I included this sign here in my next coming video in a haul that I did that will be coming up soon so please stay tuned for that these two new these items right here they are new in the vintage section these glasses are new i included that in a haul that's coming up soon but i had to go ahead and display them and i think these are beautiful additions for a fall vignette or a fall tablescape so please enjoy as um, I let you see some of the clothes that I have for sale. And just to show you a little bit of the variety right here, we're looking in the women's section. And shortly I'll show you some of the girls and the juniors and kids clothing. Okay, stay tuned. I hope you enjoy. Did you get ready in the dark or something? You look like a beautiful nightmare Don't you know?
So I also sell shoes. Not only do I sell children's clothing and women's clothing, but I also sell children's shoes, ladies' shoes, and men's shoes. Here are some of the t-shirts that I sell that I usually put the more trendy clothes out in the front. And I usually put my more dressier clothes on the inside. Uh, or maybe I may display just the newer items that I've just gotten in on the outside for those who um, are new to my channel. I just wanted to kind of give you an idea of what my setup is like. So I sell clothes and these clothes may seem like it's not the time of year to still be selling summer wear, but it stays hot in Georgia. Really, it stays warm in Georgia past... Um, uh, past Thanksgiving actually sometimes we'll have warm weather all the way up to, Dece to December and I still have customers who are coming in and buying summer items now these the uh, planters or the flowers that I just displayed I've already taken those out I'll show you guys that at a later date I also sell uh, albums you saw the stereo so I'll play albums for people who are interested in in an album just to let them know that it's not scratched as you can see I also sell books and currently my books are on sale buy one and get the other one free that's temporary but because I'm trying to move some of my older books out so that I can put some new books in that's what I currently have going on also as you can see I sell DVDs I sell maps I have customers who love to come in and buy all sorts of maps and um, especially vintage maps but there are people that just love maps because you know a lot of people really don't use maps anymore we have the GPS to help us out now but yet there are people that collect them okay guys it's time for me to wrap it up I'm so glad that you decided to tune in and watch this video if you haven't done so already Please make sure that you subscribe and that you comment and let me know what you think about my thrift boutique. Also, be sure to hit the notification bell for more upcoming videos. Until then, peace and love. <laughs>